What's up my fellow gaming nerds? I am Gaming Seth. Thank you so much for watching another video. I wanted to cover a topic I haven't seen too much information on, and that is how to get a clean race bonus. Um, so if you're playing the campaign or career mode, then you notice that sometimes you'll get extra percentages on your winnings, and that is due to a clean race bonus. Uh, so anyways, I'm just going to be going through some of the do's and don'ts for it. I hope it helps. So the first one we're going to cover is staying on the track or within the yellow lines. Um, as long as all four tires don't leave at the same time, so you don't cross that yellow line with all four tires, you won't get penalized for it. So next up we have, of course, the cutting off or boxing out of the opponent. Um, I've noticed that you can cut them off um, even if there's contact. As you can see here, he almost spun me out. Um, there is no penalty as long as you don't hit the wall so um, you can box them out they can ram you um, there can be some contact there but you won't get penalized for it and your clean race bonus will be intact so now we move on to probably the most fun I had uh, testing this out um, and it is ramming cars so I started off initially um, just kinda love tapping if you will and uh, progressively got more aggressive and even tested out um, ramming multiple cars in the same race um, like I did with the Mustang and uh, it, it never really penalized it so apparently getting rammed or ramming a car um, does not make a difference as far as the clean race um, goes this is different obviously for online but um, yeah it was kind of interesting to see um, the more aggressive I got and even sent some cars into uh, into the wall and I still was able to get my, my clean range bonus at the end so it was a bit strange but it's good to know if, if especially if it happens accidentally um, if you're not paying attention or if you come up a little too fast and you accidentally hit them from behind um, you don't have to worry too much about whether or not that just screwed up your clean race bonus on lap you know 14 of 15 or something like that um, so it's uh, something good to know but yeah it was I, it, I did have some fun testing this out it was uh, pretty enjoyable to let loose and just start ramming cars uh, and, and really race in a different way if you can even call that racing but anyways let's move on to the uh, side swiping so uh, sometimes you'll come up um, either on the inside or outside and you want to overtake and um, they turn tighter or wider on you and will clip you or you'll clip them um, more of a side swipe you don't send them into the wall and they don't send you spinning out but um, I just wanted to test it and yeah that is also acceptable so now that we covered what will not cancel out your clean race bonus I wanted to go through the major, um, I guess, infringement that will penalize you, and that is hitting a wall. So um, it didn't matter. I tried a, quite a few different variations of it, barely skimming the wall, um, slamming into the wall. It didn't really matter. Um, it was as soon as I hit it, I think I lost the, uh, the clean race bonus. So uh, yeah, stay off the wall at all cost. Um, I've only had it maybe three times where um, I was actually rammed into the wall and I was able to recover and slightly hit it and I kept my clean race bonus. But basically every other situation, um, I raced about 200 races testing various uh, theories out and yeah, I was only able to get three times. So. It, it's not very fun. Uh, the other one is when you purposefully start just hitting cars um, like I did with the Aston here, then it does cancel out the clean race bonus as well. So thank y'all for watching. I hope it was helpful and uh, I'll catch you on the next one.